Hey what's up guys, Harris here, and this is the Goofone i6, and this is my full unboxing. Now you may be asking why I'm doing another iPhone 6 clone video, uh, as I found out the other one that I did was actually the iWeco 6, or the Weco i6, uh, and you can see on the right I have the Weco i6 box, and this is the Goofone i6, a slightly different model. Um, it works a little bit better, but you can see the packaging just starting out uh, is a lot different. The Wiko 6 is a, a lot more looking like a real iPhone, whereas this Goofone i6 uh, looks just like a white box with an iPhone on the top. Alright, so unboxing this, I actually found it uh, pretty funny, as odd as that may be for a phone unboxing. We get the phone itself sitting on top in a little plastic bag sleeve wrapper thing. Underneath that, we get a very Samsung-esque pair of earphones, uh, not at all like the Wiko phone, which had actual counterfeit, but actual uh, ear pods. Then underneath that, we get two, yes, count them, two pairs of lightning cables uh, for whatever reason. Um, I think this was an accident. They probably just threw this in when they were packaging it. And then underneath that, we have a very weird-looking charging cube that just says charging on it, charger on it, and then underneath that we get two of the identical manuals, one inside a little envelope and one just sitting out, which is again super weird that they included two of the identical manuals. So go ahead and peel off the screen protector off of the Goofone i6, and I already did turn it on a little bit and set it up, but we'll take a look at that in just a second. So with this one, the power button and the home button actually work as opposed to my uh, Wiko one which did not work and you can see this is pretty much the identical design it's a white phone to have the same antennas the same kind of rounded glass on the front and the same super low res quality screen that uh, really wants to make me burn my eyes after looking at it but nonetheless it is an iPhone 6 clone running an iOS 8 skin over Android and it's pretty cool actually I really enjoyed using this it works pretty well and it's much faster than the Wiko one and it also has working speakers, and they gave me a Lady Gaga song, so it's a win-win situation for me. I get to spend money on this, and I get Lady Gaga, so uh, what's not to love here? So we're going to go ahead and take a closer look at the Goofone i6. You can see on the left we have the Wiko one, and the Wiko is really made to mimic the iPhone uh, almost exactly, but this Goof phone has more of its own style with the Goof phone logo and the Goof phone branding. And there are identical devices apart from that, despite the cracked screen that I do have on my Wiko. But you can see it's very cool, it's very similar, and it should be exactly what we can expect uh, to see design wise from the iPhone 6. And you can see just how cool it looks, how thin it looks, and it's quite comfortable in the hand, although it is just plastic pretty much uh, painted to look like metal and to feel like metal. but they did a good job. So this is the Goofin i6. If you want to see my Wiko 6 unboxing where I went more into depth than compared to the iPhone 5, I'll leave that link in the description. I hope you guys liked this. Make sure you subscribe, like, and make sure you stick around for my real iPhone 6 coverage in the fall.